to get pregnant or not to get pregnant. That's the problem. Can you afford a child? Yeah, I thought so. In this case, you need to be on birth control. But of course, the side effects will not leave you alone. First, you want to check what the side effects are. They include spotting, breast tenderness, nausea, acne, changes in hair, headaches, emotional changes, weight gain and bloating. See, not so many side effects, it just affects your whole body. But hey, you might be so lucky that you never have any side effects. To be honest, not many women are this lucky. Most women experience them after two to three months of inconsistent birth control use. If these side effects won't leave you after three months, you need to talk to your doctor immediately. Before we recommend some tips to prevent them, it's good to know whenever you start a new hormonal birth control, your body needs some time to adjust. Now, the question is, how to cope with these side effects? If you're nauseous, try taking the pill at night or after eating. For spotting, taking the pill at the same time each day will help. Experiencing headaches? Try switching to taking your pills at night. Breast tenderness, mood issues, fatigue, or back pain can be cured by eating anti-inflammatory foods and getting plenty of sleep. When couples are having any intimate sexual contact, they must always use condoms along with the pill to protect against STDs to be safe on birth control. Because you know what? Abstinence is the only method that always prevents pregnancy and STDs. I actually recommend it. Condoms are your safer sex superhero. They can reduce the risk of pregnancy and STDs. Using condoms with another type of birth control like implant, IUD, or pills give you backup protection in case either method fails. Now, pills or condoms? Which one is safer? Condoms are 98% effective at preventing pregnancy with perfect use. Contraceptive pills are over 99% effective at preventing pregnancy with perfect use. So, use them both. The relationship between birth control pills and hormones is not very good. Birth control pills may cause hormonal imbalances and terminal side effects. Now, let's reduce the effects of birth control. To minimize the side effects, stick to light and plain foods such as crackers or bread. Consume cold liquids to soothe your stomach. Avoid spicy, sweet or fried foods. Drink ginger, ale or ginger tea. Skip big meals and instead eat smaller meals throughout the day. There is a big question about birth control. Are birth controls 100% safe? No! The only way you can make sure you won't get pregnant is to have no sexual intimacy. But some methods come close. For example, if you use implants or IUDs, the possibility of getting pregnant is 1 in 100 women, less than 1%. Taking birth control pills while using some other pills must be dangerous. Some of them are antibiotics, anti-HIV drugs, antifungal medications, anti-seizure drugs, modafinil, and herbal remedies. If you're dealing with breast cancer or cancer of the uterus, cervix, or vagina, you should not be on birth control. Unexplained vaginal bleeding, yellowing of the whites of the eyes or skin during pregnancy or during previous use of the pill, and liver tumors are also other reasons not to use them. And the last warning is that they can change your body shape. Not absolutely gaining weight, but it can change a woman's body shape and composition. There are three big reasons for this, and they have to do with muscle, fluid retention, and fat. Thanks for tuning in, everyone. If you found this video helpful, make sure to like and subscribe to our channel for more content like this. Also, we'd be glad to hear about your experience in the comments. Until next time, stay healthy. Bye.